What can I say that hasn't been said before? Even the title irritates me. As if making the numeral 3 superscript in the last film wasn't bad enough, every second movie sequel back in the 90s was Something Resurrection. You'd think that Joss Whedon writing a band of morally questionable space pirates would be more of an entertaining time, but instead... Alien 3 was intended to be the last Alien movie, but after its lukewarm reception, they decided to make Alien Resurrection as a last, last movie, to end things on a high note. Instead, it's a paint-by-numbers action movie that's clearly out of ideas for truly expanding the Alien mythos, and ends up pulling itself in too many different directions, none of them very good. I like the idea of seeing the aliens underwater, it was hinted at in Aliens, but I don't know how you'd make it actually work on screen in a film, and neither does Alien Resurrection. <laughs> the casting director did a pretty good job. Winona Ryder, Ron Perlman, and Brad Dourif are all good actors, but they've really got nothing to work with here. Sigourney Weaver seems like she really doesn't want to be in there in every scene, which is understandable given how her character is written and treated. I still get weirded out thinking about how this movie was directed by Jean-Pierre Jeunet. Not because he's best known for directing Amelie, which is what most people get stuck on, but because he produced such a bland product. Having seen his other films, such as Delicatessen or The City of Lost Children, which also featured Dominique Pignon, I can understand why he got the job. His work has a very distinctive tone, it's very dark and low-key surreal, almost like a French Terry Gilliam. In the same way that David Fincher's own distinct style was a good choice to bring to an alien movie, I think that Jean-Pierre Jeunet's style is as well. The only problem is that Alien Resurrection feels nothing like a Jean-Pierre Jeunet movie. This is especially beguiling to me, knowing how much influence Jeunet had on the film. Apparently the studio let him do more or less whatever he wanted at every stage of development, and he even personally created the human-alien baby hybrid. I've heard some people say that this version of the Alien is the film's saving grace, but I honestly just find it ungainly and ridiculous, at least me personally. I actually got the chance to meet Jean-Pierre Jeunet once, back when I was in film school, and I had a reasonably in-depth conversation with him. I only asked him one question about Alien Resurrection, though. What was it like, working on an Alien movie? His response? I didn't speak English at the time. And <laughs> that's all we spoke about it. <laughs>